Hi everyone, Joe Perkins here from Daily Excel with another Excel tip for you. Just want to demonstrate to you the difference between someone telling you what to do and someone showing you how to do something. Uh, earlier, I gave you a shortcut, a great shortcut for data entry, and it was Control D. Now Control D will copy down information from the cell which is directly above it. So copy down is what the shortcut does. So for instance, if I want this cell to be the same thing, that would be 110 Pineapple Street, I could press Control D and it brings that data directly down. Now if I want that to be in multiple cells, if I press Control D, that doesn't work. Control D, that doesn't work. The way that you can get multiple cells to come down is you can select the cell that you want plus multiple cells then press control D and now all the data is populated for you it's kinda like a quick copy and paste uh, action so if you're gonna do multi select you have to have the data selected and the cells that you want it to go into and then press control D if you just want the one cell you just press control D and it brings that down and a cool trick is that you can initially do this across multiple cells. If I press Control D, it brings all of those cells down that I wanted quickly and easily. So again, if you're just going to copy one cell, or I should say into the next row, if you're just going to copy into the next row, whether it's one cell or multiple cells, you can select that range. Remember, this is the range that we have selected. It's identified by the marquee. Press Control D. That brings the data down. If you want to select, if you want to fill in that same data, for instance, in this case, New York is being filled in over and over and over. If we just want to pre-populate that all the way down, we can just press Control D because we've selected the first initial cell, and then we selected all the cells in which we want that data to be populated into. So some quick data entry tips for you uh, and usage of how the shortcut actually works versus uh, trial and error. Uh, have a great day. Again, Joe from Daily Excel.